Okay, I just did a video of coaching the dog to do this, but it, I think, it, and Aaron, if you're there, I, this helps your deliver to hand, if you said how, there's 400 damn Kleenexes in the box. You've, it's, it's just, if it was a thing that the object popped up out of, remember my platform that I was gonna invent? <laughs> but it's just, you're just, it's. Oh no, not again. He said, what happened? I don't put the pin in the gate, and the dog opens the door and comes out. Anyway, I'm going to make a video of her, but let's see what happened. She don't want this one hanging around. Mm -hmm. So this one says, I'll park myself right here. She said, is she going to be a problem? Well, probably not, because it seems to spur this one up. All right, so I got my Kleenex. I'm running out here, but... Way to do it is keep popping one out yourself so they don't get the box. <laughs> Whoops, uh oh. I gotta go get more Kleenexes, but it's because it, it gets to a certain point and then the box is kind of, it's getting too low. <laughs> she's, just, she's just tossing it. <laughs> See how she keeps trying the kiss thing. I'm looking for something else to pick up. <laughs> Hot watch. Keep her away. Try to make sure she doesn't get in there too close. <laughs> okay, let me go back to the keys. I'm just doing that real quick, but it's you're getting the real. You get a little rhythm going. You got 400 chances, or however many's in here. 190. You. Oh, hi, Brant. I was actually going to tag you because I said he's probably sitting there. He might have a cold. He might need a Kleenex. I swear to God, I almost tagged you. Okay, so now I've got the keys. And what, what? She's way more engaged now. She's like, I don't want anybody else. <laughs> She's all over me. Puts it right in my hand. So fun. All right, hang on. Let me get rid of this dog real quick and get some more treats. You guys here real quick. I've got my pager. And so I, I am using that.
Okay, so remember yesterday we started. Oh, hi, Kristen. Oh, hi, Doreen. Oh, are you off work, girl? I hope you're not watching at work. Okay, uh oh. All right, so remember I started yesterday getting the dog to the platform. And it, I said I'd have it up there by this weekend. If it went faster than I thought. All right, watch. There's my pager. Okay, so I did do a little bit of the leash thing yesterday, and I made a video of that too. But when we have this leash on, it's going to be hooked to that pager. We're not going to, if you said, uh oh, I'm trying to get the Kleenex now. <laughs> Uh, it's just, it's just going to be hooked to there. Why did you do this? Let me get the little shot first. There. Mm. Well, she's got the jealousy factor. I do think you could get another dog at some point too, girl, if you really wanted another one. After she gets way, way better though. But... Alright, so I'm only holding on to the handle. Where's my pager? Inhibition? Absolutely. It wouldn't drink water on the leash if it didn't. Drinking water is a sign of free agency. If you said, well, if you ask somebody, do you want to drink? No, I don't want to drink. I'm not thirsty. When is normal? Isn't it? Sure, I'll have a drink. Sure, I'll take a water. All right, girl, so this is you. You're going to be healing, healing. This is us at Lowe's, turning. Healing, 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 turning. North, south, north, south. If you said, what about walking in circles? No, no, don't walk in circles. Turning, that was my pager. You said, I don't like that. You're not gonna like this shit then. <laughs> you said, I don't like when her feet prance. No, you're not gonna like this shit then. <laughs> oh my God. You said, I don't like little fancy feet. Oh, you gonna like this shit then. If you want the fancy feet, all I gotta do is see them. And if you're there, Aaron, same thing. That dog will throw in a fancy foot. <laughs> stepping away, though, I'm stepping away. There's my painter. Oh my God! So as soon as her feet came off the ground, oh my God. <laughs> I am all tangled. You want those fancy feet, trust me. to get the fancy feet so there's this one Facebook friend of mine I'll, I'll share that video oh this thing's got all kind of fancy feet all right hang on let me get rid of this thing real quick okay so the other thing we were doing was getting the dog on the platform 
No, she's not going to be lonesome because she's going to have you coming home and working on this stuff for now. What we don't want is her just deciding that this other dog is better than you. All right, so, but I'm going to help you find the right one. It's going to have to be one, you know, like one of these that isn't like stirring stuff up, girl. There is such a thing. <laughs> there is such a thing. All right, so she's going to get a drink. I'm going to get her back up on the platform. If you said how, the Molly effect. <laughs> I'm not even looking at her. and I'm just going over there. She's saying to herself, she's not, what she's not saying is, oh, she's trying to tell me to get up there. Tell her to get up there. I'm trying to get over there first. I'm headed for the platform. I'm trying to get there first. Ah, oh, damn it. Damn it, it didn't work. <laughs> think how, you know, just think how you feel when. Oh, hi. Oh, Claire, Claire, you need to start working on this. up there yesterday or the day before it would now say to itself it, it's it's getting ready to try to that one's in the shaker it's getting ready to try to force me oh 
And there you go. Once it goes there on its own, if I would have not raced over there, So that's the next step. First you're racing it over there. Next you're rewarding it for going there as a default. If you said, is it gonna eventually stay up there? I didn't think they would, but they do. Well, I didn't think they would, but they do. You saw that Doberman Poppy. It was way worse than her as far as just, it just didn't move. started doing it I said it was like a gift shop but it's the prize booth get into the prize booth it's such exciting work girl. it's gonna be fun if you said we enjoy jerking on a chain and doing all these things no this isn't for you You said, well, you didn't reward her right away. You've got to be able to say, how far is it willing to go? If it had never gone up there, I probably would have. All right, so there she goes by the door, and I'm going to take off down this way. Watch. Now I'm going to race back to the prize booth. I've got to hurry and get to the prize booth. <laughs> she said, I never heard of a prize booth. Neither did she, but now she's saying, my God, a prize booth. So that's what you're gonna get. If you're doing it right, if you're doing it wrong, the second you say it can leave, it's either gonna just still lay there half dead or it's gonna run away. It's not gonna default to doing it on its own. And that's, that's reality. This is two days of doing this. All right, I'm gonna go this way, I can add my pager. I do remember there was this childhood story. I know you guys are like, oh God, no, not more of her childhood stories, but it was this book. I'm going to ask my mom if she still has it. It was about this, these ducks in China, and they lived on this boat called a junk, I guess, or maybe that was Japan. Anyway, it was all the ducks, and if you said they were Peking ducks, I think so. And there was one called Ping, and they all the ducks would get off of the boat and go, I guess, find food or whatever. And then at the end of the day, the last one on always got hit. <laughs> oh my God. I swear to God. So if you said some subliminal thing in your mind, don't be the last one, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> All right, I'm thinking of going to the prize booth. I'm not looking at her, I'm looking at it. <laughs> Gotta look through them. Anyway, girl, she's doing amazing, so I'm going to put her up for now, but I'll be back with her a little bit later, But and I did some footage, too, but I'm already loving the fancy feet, and I think you're starting to see where she's starting to look like these other ones that you've seen that are farther along, and, you know, when we get her out, we're going to work on little drills and stuff. I mean, you're not going to, if you said, well, I, I've got, you know, a lot of shopping to do at Lowe's, and I want to take her. That's later down the road. For now, you're just, you're training the dog. We, we have to probably say that prior to this she really didn't have any training look now she's staying there <laughs> and so her training is starting whenever you dropped her off and it needs to continue for a long time like you said i don't i don't, I don't want i'm not going to commit to a year of working with this dog real in earnest i know you are girl 
But that's what it's going to take. So if you said a year from now, we'll look back and laugh and laugh. Yeah, we will. It's already defaulting to sitting up there. I want you to understand if I had forced it at all, at all, or made anything other than it was her idea to go up there, the dog would be avoiding this location. I would too. If someone made me sit somewhere one time, I would think, okay, I don't want to risk going over there again because that might happen again and I might be forced to sit there. And I don't want to sit there. So it's very, very exciting work. I don't know what else to say, but it takes time. And I'm, I'm proud of you for leaving her, girl, because I think you can see what, I think you can see the progress that she's making. She couldn't, she would only engage for like five minutes before. Now I got her wrapped around my little finger. Prize booth, we got the keys, we got all this stuff. So anyway, girl, I'll be back with her a little bit later.